Hello. I'm out here in my garden and I'm going to show you my granny rocks. And I hope my dogs don't jump up and uh, try and get in the way. Where are they? Hey. Hey. Hey, Bonnie. Hey. That's my dog. I'll try and keep her out of the way. I'm going to show you my granny rocks that I paint as a hobby. There they are in the box. There's Kira. Hi, Kira. Okay, now you go away. Okay. Do I have to be paying attention to you primarily? <coughs> yes, I do. Okay. I will show you my little rocks. Okay, this one. Oops. This one is, is kind of wistful. And she's holding some forsythia. And uh, it kind of reminds me of... Um, people who are just sort of thinking in their own mind. This one, she's eating some berries or some cherries and just enjoying the taste of them. This one's got a little bouquet of daisies. She's a humble little soul. <laughs> there might be a little foggy spot on my lens. Okay. She's wearing a shawl. And this one's also got a little basket of flowers to give to somebody. I always sign them on the bottom and put the year. I've had them as far back as 95. For example, this is how I used to do them a long time ago. I just kept this one because I liked her a lot. People collect them. Some people have whole shelves of them. She's kind of a bigger one. She's very sympathetic looking and kind of wistful and she's your your friend who cares don't you love air blowers I'm sure you can hear it okay this little guy is a dwarf and he's a little harlequin clown just because the rock suggested that shape oh thank you no more air blower I'm just gonna go through them one by one without turning off the camera and see how that works. She's ready to go shopping. She's waiting for you. Let's see. This one is just some kind of a little kid thing kneeling down and holding on to her stuffed toy or him. I don't know if it's a her or a him. It's kind of a little dwarf. She's playing the guitar and singing a little bit. I got her some little teeth in there. <laughs> she was really hard to paint, actually. She's sitting on a little uh, ottoman. Here is my patriotic one. She's standing outside at the, I don't know, Memorial Day <laughs> parade. That's about when I painted her. She's kind of crazy granny. She stands sort of on her side and she's uh, got crazy clothes on. I like her a lot. I haven't varnished them yet. I was thinking that the uh, varnish would just get in the way of the colors for, for this purpose. But the varnish really does bring out more colors. She is the mysterious lady with the big caftan and the, and the orb. I'll try and maybe make that orb look glassier. Let's see. And this is Mum out on the town. It was inspired by that movie Agnes Brown about about the Irish lady in the 60s. And they would go out for the evening and leave their kids at home. And they'd be smoking a cigarette and just going out and having a good time getting away from it all. So I call her Mum. This is a quilt lady. She's kind of homeless, homely. and uh, But she's a really great quilter and she's made this... Um, nice quilt so her home is comfortable and um, that's where her beauty lies. This one's uh, the little candle lighter. Um, I tried to make her face look sort of lit from beneath. So, a couple more. This is like an old sea captain and he's got the blue eyes, he's been to the ocean, he, he, seven seas, and he's got his beret on. 
he's an old dude. I don't do too many male ones. And this is, I'm not sure how well she turned out. I like her face a lot, but her, her cat, cats kind of tend to turn out like Boston Terriers. I haven't mastered cats yet. And that's my granny rocks. I have a lot of fun painting them, and um, right now, right now a woman named Ann Jameson is getting married, and she called me and said, can you please um, paint me 12 of them? And uh, so I did, and now I like, especially the quilter and the little harlequin, I like them so much, I'm going to price them at maybe 20 bucks, because that's a lot of money for a painted rock. But that'll discourage her from buying them. But, you know, I've earned maybe a mm, couple of thousand dollars over the last 10 years doing my hobby. I don't know, I hate to sell them now. <laughs> my eyesight isn't as good as it used to be. And, but I'll keep painting them. Thanks for looking.